in the ancient clouded times of 2007, a game was released. This unbalanced and poorly optimized creation and its sequels spawned flood after flood of shitposting and some of Shadman's greatest works. Heated arguments raged on which of its trilogy was the best and who was the best waifu. But we few know the first of its name should be held above all others and which waifu deserves the speech. Today, Hamish Grimm and his alcoholic sidekick delve into the masterpiece that is Mass Effect. Watch as they rediscover the forgotten wonders, battle Geth, and become the hero the Council ignores. Pray for us. He looks like Geth. Oh. He looks like Gaston if he'd been through a fucking... Nobody takes a horse dick quite like Gaston. <laughs> God, everyone side-eyes you like they're hoping you don't get your dick out. <laughs> I'm gone. <laughs> Hello. Hey. Oh. How are you doing? Hey, doing? Sexy look. How you doing? Good looking. Mm. <laughs> oh. What the fuck? He's like stroking out after walking like two oh. feet. Are you, are, you, are you okay? It's just walking sideways along this rock wall. Oh. She can be a bumblebee. Yeah, that can be, she can wear the upgraded bumblebee and he can be the regular bumblebee. Just Professor Shepard coming up behind her. <laughs> buzz, buzz, baby. Now I can't tell my people apart. Uh. Squad bumblebee, roll out. Oh god, am I stuck somewhere I'm not supposed to be? <laughs> I would not be surprised. Yeah, game testing was a little bit loose. Don't worry, I got it! You almost killed yourself. Yep. I used to make it. Hey, fellas, did you know that this is a level 3 hazard, standing in fire? Those suits are pretty tough, eh? I mean, that bar has gone up kinda quickly. Not really, though. I'm and a... it's gone. You just... Immediately cooled. Just use them, they're going, I'm a marshmallow! <laughs> ah, look! I'm delicious, Ashley! My name is Ashley. Ashley! <laughs> oh my god. You're getting worse. I. T You're getting worse! They're a stationary target, Hamish, why can't you hit them? There you go. Are you seeing the fucking drift on this thing? I'm not even holding any buttons. It's just. Is there a whole breath button? No, it is not. Ashley, our space Kim Kardashian. Space Kardashian. Dead ass. If I find out, like if I get thrown into the future and I find out there are Kardashians at like the Kardashians. <laughs> Sorry, that's a species <laughs> from Star Wars. What? Kardashians. Are they? Am I thinking Calrissian? Yeah, you're thinking Calrissian. She's a no, that's as Lando's well. last name. Yes, yes, I'm more of that. How do you say Kardashian? Yeah, you were just calling a Kardashian as in dad ass here. I'm pretty. Oh, God. Oh, I'm an ass man, but I, they're just such trash. It's so fake. If I knew that, like, they were still around in the 22nd century, I, I would join the Geth and I would do everything Why I could. Humanity? Yeah, just do this. Intel dropped the ball, sir. <laughs> we had no idea what we were oh. walking into down there. <laughs> you can just That's why things lines. went to hell. Do you oh, think he know, can eat soup properly? <laughs> Does he have to have, like, a straw for most of his meals? Like, like, I know I've said he's not good with spoons yeah, already, but, like, <laughs> if someone else fed him with a spoon, do you think he could actually handle it? Or, like, <laughs> or is it going to make a real mess? In two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have predicted <sighs> You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? His eyes are starting to, like, tilt downwards on the outer edges as well. Nihilus is is his face like devolving as he <laughs> continues this series? Oh, what? By the end of the game, his like eyes the are sticking so we're on his like on the his cheek. The council can kiss my ass. His lips are so high up compared to the base of his chin. It's ridiculous. It's like how do you have that much jaw? I would love to see his skull because I think he's got a good like three or four inches of bottom jaw that leads down to the chin. Like someone on the crew gets assassinated by like a, a rogue, you know, a, a ninja, and they're like, "How did he get on board?" And they look at the camera footage, and it's just a ninja crouching slightly underneath his chin. I can't see him. 
He didn't. Hey, Joker. Oh, no. I've just remembered. What? The elevator. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm having fucking, fucking flashbacks, man. Oh, uh, we're going to have, like, fucking whole ten-minute segments of this stream where oh. we're just standing in an elevator. God damn. Robert, just fucking feel free to edit out the elevator scenes, man. Yeah. Well, I, I fucking fuck love this, though. Oh. Using a Mass Effect relay. Yeah. Krogan faces are based on bats. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, I can see it. Sorry, for the audience, I've just shown Hamish Grimm a picture of a bat. And he agreed. Yeah, well, we'll get Robert the fucking Ah. That's up to him as the editor. Let's do this. Oh, the UI. It's a VI. Fuck's sake. It's a virtual intelligence, not... I'm trying to pull this shit out of, like, vague memories from when I was a young man. It sounds like an excuse to me. It's all excuses. Fair enough. I hate the fucking Citadel Transit. Oh, God. I'd rather walk. You know, like, when I was a kid, I got lost in this fucking Citadel for, like, oh half an God, hour. Like, same. real time. Yeah. It takes so long to find your way around here for the first time. In fact, I'm probably going to get lost. Big arrows. I'm already lost. The arrows are going the wrong way. <laughs> to the embassies. To the Citadel Tower. Tower. That's what we want. Yes. Oh, I'll thank fuck. Hit that Give me more time. Do you think it's a sexual thing if they touch that weird spike on the back of their legs? Do you think it's a sexual thing if they touch that weird spike on the bottom of their chins? Oh fuck yes. Like I, I guess they're mandibles. Well, yeah, because they kind of move. Does the sexual the dominance is that is that, is that determined by the length of your mandibles? Because Garrus has quite small ones compared to that other guy over there, and that other guy won the argument. Is it an age thing? Like genetic, you know. Like, let me just look it up. You know, I, I want to do some research on Garrus. Turian, <laughs> Turian mating rituals. <laughs> you blew it. Uh, Sounds like he came up empty. Saren's a judgment oh, of like oh. what? Oh god. So here we go. Do you want to look at that glow on his face? Do you want to like go for a walk? I might go for a shit. You know. Yeah, head down to the bakery and grab myself a pie and a yeah. drink. Take the dog for a walk. Yeah, I, I have. Some... It's not even gonna fucking say anything. They're just gonna stand here in silence. Oh, there it is. See, the best thing about the elevators is when the characters have conversations with one another. Yeah. I love my Bumblebee squad. You force them to wear like grade one armor for the entire game. <laughs> You're wondering why they're getting one shot by like scrubs at the end of the game. Hang on. There we go. Fucking hell. Can we have a timer on that, Robert? Fucking go back and record, like, see how long that thing took and put a little timer in the corner. I, I think about alien genitals a lot and like how we're having sex with them. Or we'll have sex with them. How we are having sex with them. We will. In the future. Tense. If you don't think. That there are aliens on this planet having sex with us right now, you are wrong. <laughs> We're taking a trip down fucking conspiracy lane. What place. nobody knows is Earth. And this is canon in Mass Effect 2, or I'm. I know full well there's aliens on that planet, okay? They're from Israel. Oh! <laughs> okay! I'm gonna just step outside for a second, go to the bathroom, and just clear myself of that bad voodoo. Uh, give, give me a minute. Shit! <laughs> <laughs> this is why nobody's allowed that land. It's the first landing place. <laughs> Lizard people. This guy has just been sitting here behind cover this entire time. Oh my god, the bar fight! Oh, All right, such fuck nostalgia. This. Fuck this. Wait a second, I keep forgetting our powers. <laughs> Assassination? No. Turn that off. Turn it off. Use warp. And you missed. Can, can you actually hit him? There you go, knocked him over. Oh my god, don't crouch. And then you crouch towards him. Shotgun. Nice. And then you're running the bar, is fine. Is the Citadel, r Citadel really that lawless? Nice. <laughs> Aren't we on a mission ship? Yes. Yes, I'm sorry here not wearing much clothes. I mean, so... she's actually wearing a lot of clothes. If you think about it. Just not in the areas that
<laughs> but I think, actually, that's one of the few things where the lore for them got cooler as the game went on. Yes. Who are you? Do I know you? Oh, he's gonna sit there and say, uh, no, I'm no, your no, illegitimate no, son. Uh -huh. <laughs> this is really oh. creepy. <laughs> he's like a handsome <laughs> me. They say you yeah, it's, it's like you if you had fucked up the scales on uh, the They say a lot of things. I was too busy killing <laughs> Before and after <laughs> me. Oh my god. You have time for a quick autograph. So this, this is Mass Effect 1, and that's Mass Effect and Trauma, right? <laughs> <laughs> sure, I'll give you my autograph. What does he want? Here you go. He hands back to him, it's just an X. I can't write. <laughs> <laughs> I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. My wife's boyfriend is going to be impressed. Go oh, buddy. But next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. See? Okay, that is the most suspicious fucking thing I've ever seen. Expat. No, oh, found him. Yeah. Hey, Garrus. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart. Dude. Just walks in, doesn't even something. try to be stealthy. <laughs> Keep your mouth Hi. He's <laughs> just standing there with a gun out. Let her go. The whole shoot first, ask mm. questions later, cop thing. Can I crouch? Hey. This <laughs> is the perfect situation for the sniper rifle in this tiny, close quartered fight. Yeah, not the shotgun, obviously. Can you step out from behind cover, sir? Sir, yeah, please, I'm please. To ask you to step out from behind your cover. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Thank you for cooperating, sir. <laughs> your cooperation was noted, and we'll make sure that you get a proper funeral. Oh, you're running to get his nice shot. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get money. Doctor Michelle. When being an asshole actually works. No, I'm okay. Mm -hmm. Thanks to you, for life. all of you. <laughs> Why were the NR refuses to listen to reason. Why can't it act in an orderly and lawful manner? Be more open-minded. Don't do it, we're right again. Let the hen out talk or leave the hen It's out. not smart enough. It's because a jellyfish. It's a big, stupid jellyfish. <laughs> oh my god! It's <laughs> my superior that I deserve a promotion if I cannot convince this annoying jelly to leave. I am not unreasonable. The Hanar is free to spew its nonsense once it purchases an evangelical permit. You're pathetic. Investigate. Arrest it. <gasps> Why don't you just arrest the Hanar? I could arrest the jelly, but my superior has requested that I find a solution that does not anger the Hanar. The Hanar become vocal when they feel their religious beliefs are being suppressed. Oh my god! Jellyfish just screaming, Wee! <laughs> <laughs> In killer! In killer! <laughs> if you'd like, I could talk to the Hanar for you. I have argued that the stubborn jelly. Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? What did you choose? I don't know, I was Let's trying to skip here. to the dialogue. Oh! This one will continue to spread its message. <sighs> Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? You're breaking the law. The CSEC officer is just doing his job. You're causing trouble. This one is too humble to suggest that the CSEC officer is personally biased. But you did, well, just, you did just say that, that you piece this of shit. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who... <laughs> Because apparently I don't have enough intimidation just yet. And then you come back an hour, like a couple of hours later, stand in front of The guy's still standing there preaching. <laughs> and that time it works. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh my! We found one! We found a bug. Glitch. It sure is peaceful here. <laughs> Just trying to use the Can travel. You, there it is. <laughs> it wouldn't let me click onto it properly. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. I like that saying. That sounds really similar to a saying we have. I think Let's you go. stole it. <laughs> I hate to keep Fist waiting. What's with that neck movement? Bats? Like doing the, the neck thing? Like the, the twist to like catch the hearing of things? I guess. You've got the boys! The boys are back boys in town. Back in town. Boys, boys, boys back in town. Boys, 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 back in town. Yeah. 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 Right. That's it. <laughs> Can I stay in cover, please? 
Garrus, no! You'll be missed. I put it in the head of my aim down the side. It's a sniper. No. What? Okay. Here we go. And now it's forced me out of cover. Okay! Thank you! Oh no! Oh, what? I am not affected by my own grenades. Rex, however, is nearly dead. All up to you. Yeah. Do it. You gotta run out. We have a better chance if we stay together. Oh, no, Did you? Anything. Fuck this. <laughs> and you're dead. Locked and loaded. Locked and loaded. I lost shields. Dead. I mean, nearly two hours without one. Death. True, but it has like half tutorial, half hey. watch with jiggets. Hey, hey, it's not my fault. Okay, I didn't realize I was getting shot in the butt. Why do I have to do everything myself? Because you're a piece of shit, Fist. Oops, uh, Garrus, you want your assault rifle. Yeah. Rex. Don't mess with their stuff, they're using all the right things. They're the good boys, you're the one being a mess. I am a damn. That's a turret. Jesus. Go, go, go! Can you use their item, their abilities to push you through? Enemy is everywhere! Holy fucking shit! Use your ability, like use gas and other things' abilities. Oh, he's dead. And Rex has like shit going on. Enemy is everywhere! See, he's now a lot tankier. Why are they only shooting at me? Garrus' abilities? What about that? Sabotage! Ah, uh, see, see? It'll be down for a second. Enemy is everywhere! I didn't even get to fire. Don't oh. kill me, I surrender. Tell me where the quarry is. I won't have to shoot you in the kneecap. Aims Do it anyway. Aims at his head. <laughs> That's the truth. Stupid sexy fist. Let me do it, wait, do wait, it. I don't know where the quarian is, but I know where you can find her. Go, Rex. <laughs> the fucking oh, look on his oh face. Oh my god. The shadow broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. Now let's nice. move. We have to save that quarian. Garrus, like, I'm not sure about your method, Shepard. Do you think, like, every time he talks, his mustache tickles his nose? I believe so. My mustache tickles me, and I don't have that kind of terrible fucking lip placement. If I did, though, I'd be, I'd be very upset with myself. <laughs> what? Just look in the mirror every day. Why? No broker. Where's fist? They'll be here. Imagine being such a badass that your no facial fucking no coloration sense. gives you a skull. Your natural coloration is fucking terrifying. They're only there to be smart. No, Garrus, it's my cover. Garrus? Yes, get out of there. Oh, I could pull the trigger. Gar- they, They're frozen. Dude, it wouldn't let me shoot. There it is. Okay, Garrus is down. You get in there, Tali. What the oh. fuck? Tali! Throw some magic around. You're a mage. I am not a mage. You are a mage. There. Do the magic. Now I'll throw the other magic. As soon as... I've told you to do it. Please do it. Fuck it. Oh my god. There you go. Hey, just girl. Set me she just up. teleported. I knew I couldn't trust him. Don't worry about Fist. He got what was coming to him. Then I guess there are two things I need to thank you for. Who are you? Someone who saved your life. I don't have time for questions. I need the evidence. That's to not even no. what I was supposed I to be saying. I owe you. Can we give Bethesda you shit? Know. At least it's vaguely on the lines of what <laughs> I actually clicked on. Yeah. You could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. Uh, so apparently, got him. this is apparently what the original artist wanted Tali to look like. 
Wait, I can live more. with that. Yeah. Wasn't Instead of just alone. making her a human. Mm. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice. I quite like talking um, about Reapers. Yes, I really like that one there on the left, where they sort of have that crest. Yeah. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saturn's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. This is where we start going down the crazy train of Reapers! The Reapers are real! You don't understand! You're like, you had absolutely no reason to How is there no footage of it from the fucking planet? As the rights are like the first... Because they didn't realise that was a Reaper. They just think that's a ship. Oh. That is not good enough. There is footage of it, but they have no idea. Somewhere in the traverse. They don't believe... They don't realise that the fucking Reapers are that big. A citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. I can take Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. No, it's too soon. Humanity is not ready Fuck you, for the responsibilities that come with like the nose. It was a uh, Tory inspector. Heck fuck. And we are now a Spectre. Yep. Inspector Pistachio. Inspector Spectre. Pistachio Spectre. Yes. Detective Inspector Spistachio. What's that? You Detective Inspector Spistachio. <laughs> I, I, like, I prefer calling it Inspector because we're inside the mind of that ex Spectre. Yes, X We're gonna bring him down by getting in his mind because we're inspectors. Saren Saranthian, whatever the fuck your last name Bastard is. Didn't even thank you. What do you expect from a politician? Come on, right behind you, Shepard. Like the politicians standing up there. Should we talk to these guys about how much we hate politicians? All right, should we uh, ease yep. off there? You've just become a spectre. Yep, I think that's a good place to stop it. So I'm gonna. Fuck it. Yeah, what? I don't care about that. I want to do my level up. What are you going to finish with? Because I can fucking chuck that Intimidate in. Oh, just max that shit out. Yeah. What? My charm's gone up on its own. Yeah, like natural. I didn't do that, yeah. I think it's a... Watch my jacket. Specter thing. Nearly got shotguns. Ugh. Okay, I'll do the others later. Yeah. But, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, let me know by liking it. If you want to see more, make sure to subscribe. We'll be doing this same time every week, so come join us for the next episode of Mass Effect with me and Reese. And other than that, I hope you guys have a lovely day, and we'll see you next time. Laters, guys.